It's really hard working when you're fasting. Oh, you're fasting? Yeah, all I can have is salad, fruit, chicken, that pudding, some rice, you know. So how was your night? It was okay, you know, my usual. How many admissions? Just a few. In the after midnight? Yes, before midnight and after midnight. Okay, ready to sign up? Right. Who's the senior coming in? <laughs> it's Maged. You guys ready? Yeah, mm -hmm. go ahead. Okay, the first patient is Lana. She's a 14-year-old female with past medical history of seasonal allergies who presents with eye discharge. Two days ago, she had some runny nose and watery eyes. The patient took Benadryl, it didn't really help. And then she took Allegra, but she spoke with her aunt who sees an allergist, and the allergist had told her that Zyrtec is better than Allegra, so she took Zyrtec instead. But either way, none of them worked. So, yesterday she wasn't feeling too well. She decided to take a warm bath, because uh, usually she takes a warm bath and that helps her feel better. Um, so anyways, she took the warm bath. At first the water was too cold, so she tried to make it warmer and then it got too hot. I think she tried thrice and then she finally got it the right temperature. So after the shower, she was feeling a little bit hungry, but first she put on some comfortable pants and shirt and then she went to the kitchen to make a sandwich. She had a turkey sandwich with some mayo and tomato. Neha, Neha. What? I'm freaking believable. Just relax. My God, let me finish my sign out. Anyway, so where was I? That's when mom noticed that the patient's eyes were red and there was some discharge, like yellow discharge. So mom decided to bring her into the emergency room. So she drove her here in their station wagon and she had to stop at the gas station for gas. They passed a couple of stations, Gulf, but she doesn't like to use that one. So she ended up getting gas at BP. Um, anyways, they came here, they arrived here at 8 p.m. and that's when I saw them. All right, all right, we, we'll just, just consult GI, okay? Do whatever you want. I'm just signing out the patient. Good morning, ladies. Let's rock and roll. Forum, how are you doing? Good, how are you? Anything interesting going on? No, not that I can think of. Everyone's stable. Six o'clock. Good. She said she just checked by in a few minutes ago. Forum, tell me take a look at this baby. Mm -hmm. Tell me what you see. Um, I think it looks pretty normal. Um, keep going. Maybe the lower limb, a little bit yes. limp. Give me more. Um, take a close look at the face. I really don't know. I mean, everything looks okay, I think. Let me show you something. Take a look at this picture. Uh-huh. The baby obviously has cute dyslexia. I see. All right, I'll be back later. Call me if you need anything. Sure, I will. Oh, Dr. Simple, you gotta... So who's here today? 
So Artie, tell us about Katya. Is the uh, X24 week old female, this is day of life 84, current to the age now is 35 weeks and 6 days. She's currently doing well on room air, no A's, B's, or D's. Part A and B, B are normal. Um, baby's currently feeding 33 cc's, Q3, a special cure formula. Okay, what's the weight of the baby? Uh, she is 1.71 kilos. And how much should this baby be feeding if the baby is on full feeds today? So, she'd be 1.7 times 0.259 divided by 0.59 multiplied by 8 divided by 10. It's not very complicated. Means. How much are the feeds? How much are the feeds? Calculating. So, you take the first two digits of the weight, multiply it by 2. And that's your volume of feeds every three hours when the baby's feeding 160 cc's per kilogram per day. That's called Roth's rule. Yes? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I love this. I gotta tell you about this, okay? Alright, so 
We all live at a certain sodium. Our body is comfortable at a certain sodium level. Okay? So yours might be 136, mine might be 135. That's where I want to live. I'm happy there. Fine. No big deal. Okay, so all of a sudden I'm thirsty because my body knows I might be down a little bit. Maybe I'm 134, maybe I'm 133. So I'm thirsty. My body knows that I'm not at my ideal sodium. So I'm thirsty. And what do I do? I drink. I drink water. And I'll drink the exact amount perfect to bring me up to where I want to be. It's, it's amazing how much our body knows what exactly to do. It's great. I love it. It's so amazing. So that's what we're going to do. So we're going to bolus this patient. Another thing with this patient, okay? Um, vomiting his guts out, right? He's vomiting, diarrhea, 18 hours. Awful, awful, awful. Think he's going to die. He's retching. It's terrible, right? Okay. 18 hours later, now he's fine. He hasn't vomited <laughs> once. No more diarrhea. Back, back to normal. What's he have? Norwalk? Perfect. Norwalk. Great, great. Okay, so let's get this bolus in. Okay? All right, great. Thanks. heart disease. What do we know about this? Anybody know anything? Okay, let's talk about cyanotic congenital heart disease, okay? I need a paper. Let's go find a paper. Okay. So how do we remember them? Tricuspid Truncus arteriosus. When you put it up, you, you can't 
transposition of the arteries. So when you put up a new bag, you just add what's going. Tricuspid atresia. Tetralogy of Fallot. TAPVR. Hypoplast. I have one more question. What is the mean pulmonary pressure in the pulmonary artery of a premature baby, 33 weeks, with pulmonary hypertension? Find out. Does anyone know about a two-year-old with bloody diarrhea? Anyone? I don't see any two-year-olds. We have a 15-year-old rule out appy. But that's not what my crack team told me. So, how's the kid feeling? Does he have any pain? Yeah, well this morning he was really tender. You can't even really touch his belly. He has positive psoas and operator. Wait, so he's tender? Yeah. That's not what I heard. I didn't hear that at all. Well, that's, that's how he was. So he's tender, does he have any diarrhea? No, no diarrhea. Oh, God, that's not what I was told. Well, he doesn't. That's what our team got. All right, I guess I'll go see him. So, did he eat? I mean, no, he's been MPO. Okay, good, because you know if he does eat, you know what happens. He'll have exorcism all over the walls. And also, on a scale from zero to 10, bad. Okay, so let's pull up his fever curve. Let's see what we have. Can you pull up his fever curve? I want to see in the past 24 hours. Okay, okay. Guys, you want to go to the trailer? Okay. Sure, let's go. Let's go. Is that cold for the ball? Okay, so um, I wanted to talk to you about the PICU. Uh -huh. um, so I know that um, when we go... Mm -hmm. Wait, wait, um, first, first, first. How is the boy? Good. Good, 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 yeah. good. I heard you moved in. Everything going okay? Yeah, everything's going well. Good, it's hard yeah. to be with the boy. No babies in there yet, do you? No. Okay. No. You know what to tell me. You can tell me if you are. Yeah, no. No. All right. Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. sorry. Wait, wait, but how's everything on the floor? Any drama going on? No! Anybody there's picking no drama. on you? No, not at all. Okay, you can tell me no. if there is. I want to know. Okay, I promise. Okay. Nothing. Okay. Nothing's going on. Don't worry. All right, do. Keep going. Okay, okay. Um, so the PICU. Um, uh -huh. Just wondering uh, how much we're going to get reimbursed. So I think you get reimbursed $5. $5? Yeah. So is that all we're like, because we're going two people, so is that one five dollars for each of us, or just, you know, total? No, five dollars together. Is that going to be enough? I don't know. Cheryl! Cheryl? Yeah. Cheryl, dear, how are you? Hi, I'm Chang, how are you? Oh, good, good. Do you think we can live off five dollars for a month? I don't know. I, I guess. You yeah. have to. Yeah, we'll make it work. Yeah, you guys can do it. I know you can do it. You're so crafty. You'll, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. All right. Okay. All right, girls. So good to see you. Come right. anytime. My door's always open. Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye.
Hold on to the dream Hold on Hold on now, now Hold on and believe Though we already won We still hold on Hold on Hold on now, now We still hold on Hold on Hold on now, now Hold on to the dreams and I see you there I know you're well prepared Put aside all your fears I yeah, will answer all your prayers My team that no one cares Been working hard for years Keep climbing up the stairs Gotta know that you already there Blood, sweat and the tears now None of them can't take your shares now Enemies better be aware now Champions got a lot to bear now I'm out tell you this, I'm out swear now I had the tiger, got the stare now Carry on until we see the sun We holding on Hold on to the dream Hold on Hold on now, now Hold on and believe Though we already won We still hold on Hold on Hold on now, now We still hold on Hold on Hold on now, now Hold on to the dream Now be the strongest babes Although you know so the road is steep Pain and trouble and trial and grief But you must soak or you must want rape Our times ever will get you beat And you never will get defeat From your whole and strong concrete Do the work, can't talk is cheap Hold on to the dream Hold on Hold on now, now Hold on and believe Though we already won Still hold on, hold on, hold on now, now. We still hold on, hold on, hold on now, now. Hold on to the dream. Although the road is long, we still hold on. We carry on, we still stay strong. Today is long, but tomorrow.